A Florida cattle rancher told Fox News he doesn't believe Brian Laundrie is dead or alive in the swamp police are searching. Laundrie went missing on September 17, just two days after he was declared a person of interest in the disappearance of his fiancée, Gabby Petito. Her body was found in Wyoming, where the couple had been on a cross-country road trip. Laundrie's parents told authorities he was camping in the Carlton Reserve, a 25,000-acre recreational preserve in Florida. Alan McEwen, a rancher who has been helping the Northport Police Department in their search, remains doubtful that Laundrie would have made it more than a few days in the swamp-like woods, let alone two weeks. And if he were dead in the reserve, they'd have found the body by now. Anything dead you find in the woods, you're gonna look up, you're gonna see buzzards flying like crazy, he told Fox News. No buzzards, no body is my theory. And I haven't seen any but since laundry went missing, storms have flooded the woods and parking lot where laundry left his car, Fox News reported. If he were somehow able to brave the wet conditions, the Carlton Reserve as habitat to major predators, including alligators, panthers, black bears, feral hogs, and rat. Plus, McEwen told Fox News it's easy to enter the reserve and go off in a number of directions that lead to major highways or other wilderness areas. I've been in the woods in and out all my life. I have learned a lot in my life, and one thing I know is no one is gonna survive out there for two weeks on foot, McEwen said. Northport Police Department spokesman Josh Taylor told Insider on Monday that the search for laundry in the reserve is going to be scaled back this week and the FBI is now leading. Read the original article on Insider.